Since February 27, 2023, our system ranks Google as a hold slash accumulate, giving it a score of minus 0.919. In this period the stock has had natural movements with a gain of 0.22%. This is an average return of 0.11% per day since first recommended. In our daily updates for Google our last headline reads, Green Day on Tuesday for Google stock after gaining 0.222%. The Google stock price gained 0.222% on the last trading day, Tuesday, February 28, 2023, rising from $90.10 to $90.30. During the last trading day the stock fluctuated 2.16% from a day low at $89.52 to a day high of $91.45. The price has fallen in 7 of the last 10 days and is down by minus 4.95% for this period. Volume has increased on the last day along with the price, which is a positive technical sign, and, in total, 7 million more shares were traded than the day before. In total, 29 million shares were bought and sold for approximately $2.66 billion. In the last 52 weeks, the highest price of the stock was $144.16, and the lowest price was $83.45. Right now the price is 37.36%, or $53.86, below 52-week high and 96.43%, or $2,436.69, below all-time high June 11, 2021 where the price hit $2,526.99. The stock lies in the lower part of a wide and weak rising trend in the short term, and this may normally pose a very good buying opportunity. If the lower trend floor at $89.43 is broken, it will firstly indicate a slower rate of rising, but may also be an early warning for a trend shift. The current three-month trend indicates a possible 2.34% change over the next three months, with a possible return between 1.36% and 24.1%. The 12-month trend it indicates a minus 29.17% change over the next 12 months with a possible return between minus 45.18% and minus 16.99%. This equals a price between $49.50 and $74.96 after a year. Analyst Ratings and Price Targets on Friday, February 3, 2023 Piper Sandler set price target to 120. On Friday, February 3, 2023 Raymond James set price target to 119. On Friday, February 3, 2023 Oppenheimer set price target to 155. On Friday, February 3, 2023 JP Morgan set price target to 118. On Thursday, January 26, 2023 Oppenheimer set price target to 130. From analysts Google stock received a general buy rating. The analysts give P.E. ratio a strong buy and price to book a strong buy rating. For the return on investment the analysts give the stock a neutral rating. The following signals have been found for Google. A buy signal was issued from a pivot bottom point on Friday, February 24, 2023, and so far it has risen 1.06%. Further rise is indicated until a new top pivot has been found. Volume is rising along with the price. This is considered to be a good technical signal. Some negative signals were issued as well, and these may have some influence on the near short-term development. The Google stock holds sell signals from both short and long-term moving averages giving a more negative forecast for the stock. Also, there is a general sell signal from the relation between the two signals where the long-term average is above the short-term average. On corrections up, there will be some resistance from the lines at $91.32 and $96.18. A breakup above any of these levels will issue by signals. Furthermore, there is currently a sell signal from the three-month moving average convergence divergence, MACD. Here are some other signals you might find interesting. Moving average convergence divergence, sell signal. Pivots, buy signal three days ago. Bollinger, buy signal 25 days ago. Short-term moving average, sell signal 15 days ago. Long-term moving average, sell signal 8 days ago. 
The relation between the short and the long moving averages. By signal 8 days ago. If we look at the 12-month chart we see. Short moving average, sell signal 15 days ago. The long-term moving average, by signal 10 days ago. The relation between the short and the long moving averages. By signal 4 days ago. Remember to go to our page at stockinvest.us if you want to find more signals. Support, Risk and Stop Loss for Google Google finds support from accumulated volume at $89.35 and this level may hold a buying opportunity as an upwards reaction can be expected when the support is being tested. This stock has average movements during the day and with good trading volume, the risk is considered to be medium. During the last day, the stock moved $1.93 between high and low, or 2.16%. For the last week, the stock has had daily average volatility of 1.7%. Let us have a look at some fundamental data you should be aware of before we tell you some possible good trading levels for Google. The price to earnings ratio, PE ratio, is the ratio for valuing a company that measures its current share price relative to its per share earnings. Google currently has a price earning ratio of 19.22. This is an relatively low price to earnings ratio and either signal a low expectation for the future of the company or that the stock is undervalued and could indicate a buying opportunity. Here are some possible good day trading levels. On an upturn, Google meets first resistance at $95.46. If you do not hold Google shares you should wait for this level to be broken before placing your bet. If you already have the stock this is the level you may want to swing trade. On a downturn Google finds first level of support at $89.35 and this is a natural place to put your bet if the support holds with an expectation of a rebounce upwards. The average ratings combined from several analyst sources for Google is buy. Here are some of the latest insider trades. On February 6, 2023 Ferguson Roger W. Jr. made an inside buy of 5,580 of Class C capital stock. On February 6, 2023 Ferguson Roger W. Jr. made an inside sell of 5,580 of Class C capital stock. On February 1, 2023 O'Toole Amy Thuiner made an inside sell of 637 of Class C capital stock. On January 25, 2023 Mather ANN made an inside sell of 340 of Class C capital stock. On January 25, 2023 O'Toole Amy Thuiner made an inside sell of 783 of Class C Google stock units. Based on the 100 latest insides trades, we have calculated the insider power to be negative at a ratio of 0.474. In total, the insiders bought 3,520,456 and sold 3,561,466 shares in the last 100 trades. Our recommended stop loss is $84.56, minus 6.36%. This stock has medium daily movements and this gives medium risk. Low RSI 14 is 13 which reduces the risk sum. There is a buy signal from a pivot bottom found two days ago. Is Google stock a buy? Google holds several negative signals and this should be a sell candidate, but due to the general chance for a turnaround situation it should be considered as a hold candidate, hold or accumulate, in this position whilst awaiting further development. After analyzing the volatility and movements for the last trading day our systems find that the current price is undervalued. For the trading on Wednesday first we expect Google to open up $0.123 and start trading at $90.42. We remind you that trading involves a high risk of losing money, and that you should speak with a financial advisor before buying or selling any securities. You should not base your investment decision upon stockinvest.us. By using the information you agree and are held liable for your own investment decisions. This is our current view of the stock. Do you agree or disagree? Comment below and share your thoughts. What is your target for the stock? Remember to 